Lord Bonner. Thank you, Deputy Speaker. It takes a special kind of person to sacrifice their own time and energy to help another. And while they may not necessarily have the resources to give, it is those who are of exceptional character who persevere and get the job done, even when there is no reward and oftentimes no recognition. It's this unique sense of humility, duty and compassion for others that is rare and so worthy of celebration. This is why I host the annual Bonner Volunteer Awards, to recognise some of the very best in our community. We had over 60 nominations this year, our highest to date, and it was my very difficult task to narrow down these to just five awardees. Congratulations to all those who were nominated. The quality of each of your stories is a testament to the community spirit and the dedication of so many. Bonner locals are the best. In the young volunteer category, Xavier Curry of Mansfield State High School took the win. Xavier sacrifices much of his time to working with organisations such as Emanuel City Mission and the Brisbane City Council's Homeless Connect. Thank you for your service, Xavier. The Senior Volunteer of the Year, of the, of the Year Award was presented to Gavin Gray for his work with Ozfish. Gavin has helped construct and deploy 10,000 robust oyster banks which now filter 1.2 million litres of water each hour, creating homes for 21 million new marine animals and addressing the need for more habitats and biodiversity in our bay. Yeah, yeah. The Adult Volunteer of the, of the Year Award was given to Meryl Bennett, the Register of the Winter Manly Junior Rugby League Club. She is committed to ensuring that all players are properly documented so they can participate safely. And last year, the club even offered Merrill a paid position, but she declined, saying, use the money for the kids. Well done, Merrill. Sailability Bayside took the win for the volunteer group of the year for their work providing wheelchair-bound people with the opportunity to set sail in two-person dinghies. Thanks to the dedication of the Sailability volunteers, many more people will have the ability to enjoy our beautiful Bayside. And finally, I present the George Camburis Memorial Award. This special award recognises volunteers who have shown outstanding resilience, excellence and compassion in providing support for others in Bonner. George Camburis was a Carindale local who, despite being born with spina bifida, dedicated his life to mentoring young individuals and enabling them to participate in sports. George made an immeasurable contribution to our local community and has left a long-lasting legacy. And I was proud to present the George Camburis Memorial Award to Tom Price, Wilson Griffin and Jacob Marchant on behalf of You Are Not Alone. Congratulations to all those who were recognised and who were nominated.